Hi right, guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to turn any printable file into a PDF. First of all, open your internet browser. I actually found out about this when my father was trying to read a Deja Vu file on the iPad. And the iPad's um, good reader didn't support Deja Vu's. So use the Bullzip PDF printer, search that on Google. And he converted the Deja Vu to a PDF and he lived happily ever after. Now, all I want you guys to do is download the Bullzip PDF printer. You will need something that can open zips. Once you've done this, there are gonna be a there's gonna be an executable file in the um zip file. So open it up and this is basically gonna bring up the installation menu. Choose your language, just accept the agreement. Blah 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 blah. Okay, now you it is completely necessary to install Ghost Script Lite, otherwise this won't work. Okay, so let's do this. <coughs> anyway, so you can also turn them into other files like images, not just PDFs. But I think PDFs is the most useful one because you can convert anything. So a PDF and like um read it on Good Reader on the iPad or iPod. Um, it's actually what it does is it pretends it's a printer, and what happens is you actually print it, but it doesn't physically print anything. Um, it prints it into a PDF file or a image file or various other types okay so it's installing our driver creating a printer and yeah you will get a new printer when this is done called Bullzip PDF printer it will pop up and show you it and it will automatically become the default one so if we close everything out and open a text editor or anything that you can print in I'm going to use Open Office Org Writer. You can now type in and create your own PDF. I'll show you how this is done. This is a custom PDF by Tista International. Okay, there we go. Now go to File and Print. And make sure the bullshit PDF printer is selected. It will pop up in a minute um, with a uh, page that you can choose all the options on. PDF, image. Um, anyway, you can choose where you want to like create the PDF file. So I'm going to choose my PDF folder, which I created just for this video. And call it custom PDF. Now we're going to hit save and it'll pop up just here and it'll open our PDF and you can actually see the PDF in the folder you saved it to which is just here and there it is how to turn any printable file into a PDF or any other um, type of file almost any other. anyway